Greetings. This uh, is going to be a study on the smartest man of the world. This picture here, uh, I'm sure everybody recognizes him, is Albert Einstein. He's Jewish, and uh, he is, according to the media, he was the smartest man that ever lived. Well, you know what? Let me tell you something. Einstein was once asked how it felt to be the smartest man alive. Einstein's reply was, and I quote, I don't know. You'll have to ask Nikola Tesla. Hmm. Tesla, huh? Okay. Who is Tesla? Well, we'll get to that in a minute. Um, Jewish Albert Einstein was given credit for the equation E equals MC squared, which is uh, energy equals mass times the speed of light squared. But according to a lot of people, it was discovered by the German Christian scientist by the name of Max Planck and others, you know, depending upon who you ask, uh, people come up with an idea and then others expound upon it, but what can I tell you? All right, who is Nikola Tesla? He was from Serbia and he said, quote, the gift of mental power comes from God, divine being. And if we concentrate our minds on that truth, we become in tune with this great power. Unquote. Nikola Tesla is the reason you have a computer and many other things. So let's take a look. Tesla also said, My mother had taught me to seek all truth in the Bible. Well, I understand Tesla had Christian clergy in both sides of his family. So, what were the inventions and achievements? Tesla invented what is known as alternating current, AC, 110 volts. You know that electrical plug outlet? on the wall of your house? Well, that's what he invented. AC is the form in which electrical power is delivered to businesses and residences. AC is still used in, pre uh, in the present day. Tesla also established what's called the Tesla coil, a type of transformer circuit. That is used in televisions and radios to this day. He also invented wireless communication, the transfer of information without the use of enhanced electrical wires. In other words, he replaced the telegraph, which was basically like telephone wires. And then he invented the Tesla electric car. No, not, not the Tesla car, but, you know, the, um, the modern electric car. Tesla invented probably the first electric car. He did. Uh, an electrical motor prototype that inhibited a brushless design. And he also won the contract to power the Niagara Falls with his electrical current system. You know, Niagara Falls, the hydroelectric dam. So, well, Tesla said all people everywhere should have free electrical sources. Electrical power is everywhere present in unlimited quantities and can drive the world's machinery without the need for coal, oil, or gas. He would have put the oil companies out of business. Uh, Sterling Allen said, Nikola Tesla was not in this for the money. He wanted to give the world free energy. If we were to implement free energy in the tradition of Nikola's, Nikola Tesla, then we only need to replicate not only his science, but his humanity. He invented the AC generator and AC motors, without which uh, we wouldn't have refrigerators, air conditioners, uh, you know, power drills, everything. All this stuff came from Tesla. So, you know, it's uh, very, very important, the things that he gave us. 
uh, Tesla had a way to give light off light bulbs without wires. Power generated from just the air. Very innovative, and yet it's generally not in use. So, you know, if, uh, if there's free power from the air, how does the uh, electric company send you a bill, right? They can't. So they shut him down. This is a picture of Tesla's uh, power generator. And, uh, you know, you got to realize this guy was doing this over a hundred and something years ago. Guy was an absolute genius. Um, he was from Serbia. And when Serbia was fighting against the Muslims, guess who President Bill Clinton bombed? Yep, the Christians. You got it. So, all right, Tesla coils. They make TV possible. If it wasn't for Tesla coils, we wouldn't have television. And uh, he made virtually no money on this stuff. When he made money, he took the money and plowed it back into experiments where, to try to better mankind. When people were using his patents, he didn't demand money from them. He, as long as it was going for a good thing, he, he didn't ask for any money. Oh, Tesla coils are also used for radio. You wouldn't have radio it wasn't for Tesla coils. Um, he did so much work. Uh, there was a guy named Marconi who uh, took all of a lot of uh, Tesla's inventions and put it together to make the radio. But and he's credited for inventing the radio. And he was a genius in his own right. But without Tesla's coils, we wouldn't have radio. Impossible. Well, now TV is nothing but propaganda. And um, state-sponsored business propaganda. You know, there's only six major corporations that own all the networks. And, uh, you know, <laughs> they make Einstein, Jewish Einstein, the smartest guy alive. But uh, you got to understand why. They're part of the same tribe, very kosher. Okay, guess which one of these two you're teachers decided not to tell you about or didn't know. Thomas Edison, a wealthy businessman that created a way to charge money for electricity and control the energy resource. Um, Edison invented what is called the incandescent bulb. Uh, those are the most popular light bulbs. They are the ones that are pear-shaped, you know. And uh, Tesla was the inventor that created renewable energy and was more concerned about people than money. Tesla invented the neon bulbs. Yeah, you know those uh, light colored lights that are shaped signs, neon signs? He also invented fluorescent lighting. So uh, at the state fair in Chicago, I forget what year, Edison wouldn't let him use his light bulbs because Tesla was in charge. So Tesla just invented the fluorescent light. So, you know, what can I tell you? Um, let's see. So, yeah, Tesla invented the um, fluorescent bulbs, the power of the Chicago World Fair. I forget what year. You can look it up. Because Edison would let him use their light bulbs. You know, he had a patent and everything. So, so Tesla was Christian. And evidently, being Christian gets you deleted from the history books from your contributions. Did you notice Tesla was white? Ooh. So, how does that work, people? Uh, all right. So, let's see. And last but not least, uh, we have here a um, screenshot of stuff. Take a look. <laughs> 